at first it was very tough for us to cope up with the online classes we felt lost we we could not feel that you know we are there with our friends again health is a problem work habits is a problem lifestyle is a problem education is a problem 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 prothom prothom bhishon oshubidha hoyechilo mane emon ekta oshubidha jar kono solution pachhilam na corona jesi mahamari se pura desh pareshan hai और कहीं ना कहीं इस महामारी से अगर कुछ ज्यादा प्रभावित हुआ तो है शिक्षा वेन द पैंडमिक हिट बेसिकली वी वर वेरी एंशियस अनसर्टेन वॉट इज गोइंग टू है हाउ लॉन्ग वी हैव टू स्टे लाइक दिस ऑफकोर्स देर वे एडवर्सिटीज एज इट ऑलवेज एट द एडवेंट ऑफ एनी थिंग न्यू एंड दिस वॉज नॉट जस्ट एनी थिंग न्यू दिस वॉज पैंडमिक academic year uh, came to an end on the 17th of march this year with a lot of uncertainty we were sure we had to shut down for a break of 10 days and um, of course we could not open because of the pandemic and we weren't sure how this how how long this is going to last and we were supposed to start classes on the 8th of april and we did not want to miss any time you know uh, so I'm very proud of the fact that we took the call of not uh, letting the pandemic stop us and with the hashtag learning will never stop at FLS we uh, started our online classes on the 8th of April as scheduled so the academic year started on that very day and classes went on as normal we had seven periods a day live online classes and not just classes we were also doing online uh, elocutions debates uh, we had regular meetings with parents and uh, teachers so i am very proud of how much we have achieved in the last 7 uh, to 8 months yes online classes were helpful but compared to the physical classrooms it is nothing in front of the physical classroom the teachers were also facing the problem because all forms of educational organizations were closed that means what students should stop learning that is in the solution so when the government announced the uh, lockdown the teachers and the staff of the school were faced with two choices one was to remain in sponsored in the school the other was to go home and uh, you know uh, uh, the quintessential staff and uh, the teachers of the senior wing decided to stay put the others left and ever since then things have not changed we have ensured that those who have remained in the school remain in the school they do not go out so that it minimizes the chances of being infected and uh, those who are at home have been asked to stay at home until and unless the green signal comes from the government uh, in the meantime however uh, since we have uh, since we started doing the high, the online classes we observed that certain subjects Uh, for example those which are of a slightly you know technical nature for example physics or chemistry or mathematics for that matter now, these subjects while being taught through online classes uh, there were several complaints not exactly complaints but concerns from the parents as and the students especially that uh, they were not able to understand the things as they used to in the regular classes and uh, therefore Uh, we had several requests from the students as well as from the parents if uh, it would be at all possible to allow some of the students especially those students who are preparing for the board exams this year or in the next year uh, to come and stay in the hostel and uh, you know uh, receive the lessons in person in regular classes therefore the parents approached the school with the idea that it would be better if we were sent back to school for our academics and also for our health because if we are cut off from the rest of the world it will be safer here therefore uh, the school accepted the proposal and we were sent here but after coming here we could not immediately meet our friends like we had thought we will because we were put in a strict 14 day long quarantine here after coming back to the school when we were on our own basically only our meals were not cooked by us it was sent to us in tiffins otherwise everything on our own and it was only after this period that we got together 
we all the friends and we started having fun and after that of course we are feeling much better in our every aspect every students were allotted single room so that uh, we could abide by the principles of social distancing so festivals are a really important part of our life and as a bengali i would be really sad if i had to miss durga puja due to the pandemic and it was going to happen but since i came back to school i was able to celebrate durga puja with the same pomp and show and i'm so very lucky and i feel privileged to stay in a residential school we have asked only those students to come those who have their board exams school is closed but our service towards the society has not stopped we the residential teachers are taking online classes as well as offline classes for those who are here uh, many of the students as well as parents they felt that possibly the desired outcome you know development was not being seen though they were we could see uh, many of the teachers those who were comfortable in the uh, classical setup of physical classroom they also felt the need to come back and so the parents are now requesting us over and over again and we are actually pondering over it and uh, as some of them have come back gradually the teachers we are thinking of going for the flipped classroom as well as hybrid classroom and trust me it is proved to be effective we have seen it the result is in our hand love trust triumph love ye bhaiya